An area of great human, natural and climactic variety, West Africa is inhibited by indigenous and migrant populations that have lived for at least 10,000 years in an area larger than the United States. The geography and biodiversity of West Africa have inspired and challenged its people and contributed to their distinct and rich cultural heritage. In the north, the basins, oasis, mountains, dunes, and the blowing sands of the Sahara Desert influence the attire of its nomadic peoples, as well as their architecture, folklore, and oral traditions. In the south, rivers and other waterways feature prominently in the regional myths of origin and legends of conquest and resettlement textures, and sounds of diverse flora and fauna in the forest region influenced its rituals and performances, its instrumental and human music, the iconography of design of its visual arts and attire. The Saharan sands, the barks, fibers, and roots of the Sahel, the semi-desert area on the southern fringe of the Sahara from Martinia and Segal to Chad. The woods and metal ores of the forest are found in jewelry, musical instruments, sculpture, clothing, and decorative arts. While the different regions contributed to the artistic diversity of West Africa, they have also unified geographically scattered cultural groups. In fact, it is possible to argue that trade and migration across the Sahara unified East and West in the Northern region of the continent. Similarly, Waterways such as the vast niger banu River system facilitated dialogue among cultures and peoples of many parts of West Africa. For instance, the forceful winds that carry Sahara sands across much of the region are associated with such deities as Oya, one of the many female deities of the Yoruba, an ethnic group of southwestern Nigeria and Benin.